Okay, the main goal is to try to remove uh, fog, haze from video scene. Um, in the fog and haze, you'll see that in ocean environments or just on top of building, looking out to the landscape. You, there's a lot of motion. You want to be able to pan a video and get that cloud or to get the fog and haze out of there and get the true color from the scene and more vibrant. Um, it's very applicable for surveillance and for uh, movie scenes or anything like that. And there's also application for underwater video too. So the idea is to bring in the true image based on an image affected by weather, by fog or haze. So this is the input image and you want to take out the fog. You can see a lot of contrast, a lot of color coming out of here. And from this method you can also get the depth variation. So this dark means it's closer, bright yellow means it's farther away. And my idea is to try to implement it in video because current methods it takes a long time to process. My new idea, the proposed idea is to use a, a different color space. You rotate your color, your RGB color cube, and you rotate it in line with the common color in the in the haze or fog. So it could be like smoke, you get more of a reddish hue, fog is kind of gray, but from that in video, try to move everything and you get a bright contrast image. So if you're looking at an apple and you can see the reflectance of a, of a lamp on it, there's a, there's a method to remove that and just get the apple image. Um, so that same idea, I'm trying to remove weather, uh, haze and fog by rotating the color space. Well, when I graduate, I, I currently work at Spaywar, and uh, so I'll be going back there and really, uh, I'll be at a position of being able to do research and push new ideas uh, with what I'm doing already. So. Great. All right. Thanks very much. All right. Thank you. And I'm assuming your email is on the web. I'll just send you a note when this comes up so you can see it.